What's going on, everybody? Oni Mike here, and I'm back with more Ark Survival Evolved. Uh, this is episode two, and where we left off was that we just eaten, and we had all this stuff built up. Let's get up underneath here. Let's get by our fire. It's nice and warm. So let's go ahead and check how much more meat. As soon as this all gets done, we want to put this out. I don't want to waste the wood. Um, but I will make a torch. What do we need for the torch? We need more wood. Yeah, okay. So as soon as this is done, here, let me just go ahead and get that. And I'll go ahead and make a torch. Because we're going to go out and... Something's walking out there around me. It's freaking me out a little bit. Um, but what we want to do, we want to go ahead and... Uh, go out and explore. Uh, not explore, explore, but we need more items. We need lots more items and we're gonna leave our door open so we do not have to uh, freak out when we run back. Let's get some more fibers. We're gonna need fibers and thatch. Thatch is looking like a real big one. I know we do need wood also, but the wood is very easy to get, and it's so heavy, so we don't want to carry too much wood to start with. So, one good thing, we can use our torch to get ta thatch. Thatch. And it actually does not damage the uh, torch anymore. Dang, dude, just walking along, dropping them. Um, that is the good thing about this torch, that the only life it has is the burn life. It does not have, um, health right now, which I'm pretty sure it will in the future, because, I mean, if you hit something with a torch, I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna mess it up. As you can see, each time I hit E, and my flame goes a little bit away from me. That light shows, or I mean, uh, the cold symbol thing shows up. Go ahead and finish getting this stuff. Uh, maybe we'll be able to uh, finish our roofs today. That would be nice, huh? Be able to get that done up. And so we can start, um, basically we, we, we want to get hunting. After we get our building fully set up, we want to go hunting. We're going to need food, we're going to need hide, we're going to need all that good jazz. And we're not going to get it just sitting around. This is not a game that you can sit around in, okay? You definitely cannot sit around in this game, or you will die. Like, already, I am starving again. So let me go ahead and take this wood out. Oops. Yeah, I'm gonna need that wood. Let's go to craftables and let's make roofs. Let me see how many I need first before I make too many. I'm going to need one, two, three, four, five, six. So I need six altogether. So where's our roof at? Our roof is number eight. If you just hit eight when your things were in the hot bar. Bam, it starts crafting it. Okay, so I can make four. That's good. That's good. And all we need is one more. Okay, maybe I only need five. Let's see what we're missing for one more. Alright, let's go in here. Go in our craftables. And see one more. We need thatch and wood. Okay, and we don't need much of it at all. So let's go ahead and finish that real quick. Because we want to go ahead and get that done. Let's get this guy. Let's 
sorry I'm being so quiet. I'm just looking out because uh, yeah, it is not smart to actually build on the beach line. Um, but it's the easiest really to see in. So let's go on out here and get us a drink. Now you do have to be fully submerged before you actually drink. There we go. No! I didn't want to make the wall shoot. Okay, I can make the roof still at least. I did not want to make another wall. And this guy eats like a monster. Okay, he's like non-stop eating. And there's our last roof. There we go, guys. So I'm uh I'm pretty excited. Look at this. We got us a nice little thatch house started up. Set up and good. Um which I really like, and we can always expand. Now, if I'm not mistaken, we can use the roofs as floor. So if we could do that, then I, I kind of wanted to set some stuff going out a little further. Or we can always just go up and out. Uh, but for now, this is going to do it. This is going to be our nice base. And, um, you know, this way it's hunkered down. It's fortified. It, not fortified, but, you know, we're hunkered down. And what we'll do, once we learn, like, all the wood building stuff. Because, look, come over here. Let's see if we can see it. Uh, can we see? Yeah. Okay, wooden foundation, wooden walls, uh, standing torch, um, stuff like that. Um, we will learn all that stuff in time. And then once we do, we can slowly take down wall by wall and replace it, floor by floor, and replace it and stuff like that. So we will be doing that. But um, for right now, all I'm going to do is we're going to hang out here and we're going to wait for morning time. So you see how dark it is? My torch is going to be burning up in like seconds. So it's going to get very dark. And then uh, we're just going to sit here until morning time because I don't want to die and then have to start this over for you guys. So there it is. All right. So when it's morning time, we shall be back. Okay, after I bought you, welcome back. And it is morning time, and what I did, I took that extra wall and I set it up here because I want to set my bed back here. So I figured, why not? You know, we'll, we'll have a little closed off area, and we'll put our bed back here when we get it made. Um, for now, what we want to do, we're going to go ahead and drop these stones because they're weighing us down. They're 15 pounds, or 14 pounds for 28 of them. So we're going to drop them and see how long we got. Um, hopefully we can level in two minutes and get back to them because even though they're just stones um, when you start getting up there you do need them so especially when you get like a, a man this lag is horrendous especially when you get a uh, I can't even think start making other weapons like the slingshot once we make the slingshot we will definitely want some, uh, oh, look at this little guy. Shit. I don't have really the means to fight him. I, I really don't want to fight him yet. Let's go. Let's fight him, though. If we weren't lagging... There we go. Okay, so I did this thing pretty good. Let's get some hide off of him. It was that lag that killed me, man. I hit that stupid lag spike right beforehand. And that's another reason why I launched uh, Low Memory, because even on the other one, it's way worse. Let's go ahead and run back and see if we can... Uh, oh, shoot, we don't learn. We don't know the, the recipe yet for it. But we do want to heal up. And eat and all that good stuff. So we got some decent hide out of him at least. Okay, so let me go ahead and pick this up. 
and see how we're almost weighted down. Um, how much further? Not too much further until we hit the next level. And we really want that next level to uh, to learn the bed and uh, possibly the storage. Because as of right now, there's nothing. Oh, there's a Megalodon. Let's go look at him. You guys want to look at him? Let's go look at him. You see how close he comes to the edge? Look at him. They're fighting. Nice. Oh, they're fighting the turtle. Poor turtle. He doesn't stand a chance. But you see what I'm si saying on the size? These megalodons are tiny. Okay, that that's a tiny uh, a tiny shark. You know, con considering it's supposed to be a megalodon. I mean, w when you think of a megalodon, you, you think of like a skyscraper in the water. At least I do. Maybe you don't. Maybe you're a little different. I don't know, not too sure, but I know when I think of, stop lagging, when I think of Megalodons, I think of uh, ginormous, oh look, there's another little Dio guy, I'm going to save our other piece of meat for healing, look, he's kind of just stuck up there. But we're going to leave him alone for right now. Now the other guy did uh, so much damage because he was a higher level. He was 14. Uh, the lower level guys, they don't cause a whole lot of problems. And what is this? What is this? Brontosaurus is okay. Oh, I know this area. I was watching a Let's Play and this is where some uh, serious shit went down. T-Rex! T-Rex right over there. I knew it. Yep. And then right up over there is where all of the saber tooth tigers and mammoths and everything else are. So, um, oh, look at him. He's done for. He's done for. Don't you come back this way. Okay, well, he got himself a meal. Wow, well, we want to stay away from that. Um, holy shit, I'm scared. And there's really no place to, uh, to get across. Well, we know the T-Rex is. That's good. Hopefully there's not more. Because we really can't take them on. I, not really. We, we can't take them on at all. Come on, I want a thatch. There you go. Thank you. We want to get quite a bit of ways away from him. It's alright, turtle. Oh, you're level one. Man, if your homie wasn't over here, I could kill you. And the only reason why I would kill her is because of uh, food, hide, and uh, level. It's the only reason why I would kill her right now. Oh shoot, I need to watch out. Be careful around this area. That little d -Lo guy was running around here. What level are you? You're level six. Maybe we'll keep you around until we're ready to train you. Because we shouldn't need too much. Where's our base at? Still back this way? Yeah, it's back this way quite a ways. Um, you know, we could go ahead and honestly try to tame him. Uh, I, I don't have a... Yeah, I don't have that really, so... Shoot. I don't know if I could tame him or not, because I'd have to knock him out. And to knock him out, it's very difficult. Very difficult to knock him out. So, let's try it. Come on, come on, get him stuck. 
Oh, and he, they let him climb over these giant rocks now? And he's already gone. Yep, he got gone on me, didn't he? Yeah, he did. And he straight disappeared. And I'm already thirsty. Oh well, we'll see him again. Yeah, I know. I don't like getting uh, drinks of water by these sharks. Really wouldn't be a great idea. You know what? Instead of knocking this guy out this time, uh, maybe I'll just kill him if I see him again. I'll use my spear on him. Dodos. Where you at, Dodos? Come here, little Dodo. We need your flesh. I hear you, but I do not see you. Well, let's go ahead and uh, pick this stuff up and try to uh, clear out a little area here so we can see. Um, hopefully, we'll be getting that level here really soon because we really need it. Now, I am not too thrilled at the way the leveling system works. Uh, for crafting stuff, you literally get one experience. No matter what you craft, no matter what it is, you get one experience. And um, that is bullpucky, I think. Now, you do get um, experience just for being alive. I think it's like point three. Excuse me. You get like point three experience just for being alive, so. Um, but it does go very slow, no matter what you're doing. Um, as you can see, we have a whole pretty decent sized house. We've already killed a couple things, and we're only at level three or four, so. You know, it's not huge. Come on. Don't go away from me. There we go. Oh, we got more. Level 16. And there's another one. Where'd you go? No? Okay. Now, I, I want hide, but I also want meat, so, I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of in the middle right now. And that one just gave me a bunch of meat. Now, where'd this other guy go? Well, hopefully we find him. Oh, and we got our level, though. That's good. That's good, because we, uh, we want the movement speed again. I know it's a little opposite of what everyone else does, but like I told you guys, you can't eat what you can't catch. So, if you're able to run fast enough, you can get the heck out of dodge. So let's go ahead and level up, and we're going to go movement speed. And then the first thing we want is, oh man, we need a box, 6, 12, we're going to need box and slingshot first, I feel. So let's go ahead and learn slingshot and then our box. There we go. Now let's go back and make this stuff. I want to make, you, you know, you guys are going to get it. Okay, that's just all there is to it. You guys are going to end up getting it. So, that's going to be that. That is my goal, is to tame a Megalodon and a T-Rex. I did tame a uh, Carnosaurus, a uh, Carnor, or whatever they're called. Okay, it's like the step up from a Raptor and step down from a T-Rex. Um, they're pretty vicious. And I trained one yesterday. Um, actually got a hold of him and went to work on him. What I was able to do was able to actually get him in a glitch. Um, it, it, it happened on accident. 
really. But I got lucky, you know. I was able to get that glitch, and I got lucky. So these are the two berries I like to eat when I have to eat berries are the blue and the red ones. For one reason, they do okay filling, and if you just keep pressing it, pressing it, pressing it, pressing it, pressing it, you do not have to wait. Okay, I know some people said, you have to wait, you have to wait. No, that little bar, I mean that little meter on the right hand or left hand side, it shows a piece of meat, and it shows a up symbol or whatever. Okay, that is, oh, it's raining. That is our food intake, and it will go up slowly and slowly and slowly and slowly. So, yes. Now, what we need to do now is make some stuff. We want our bed. What do we need? Oh, we need more hide. Okay, so we can't make our bed. What do we need for this? Wood? We need wood and wood and wood. Okay, so we need wood. There it goes. There comes the rain. <laughs> so we want to go ahead and uh, grab us up some wood. And the music is creepy. It reminds me of like Jurassic Park. Like seriously. And I'm pretty sure they did that intentionally. But yeah, it's pretty creepy. And as you get weighted down, even though it, it doesn't say like you're encumbered. Oh, that fire scared me. Okay. Um, even though it doesn't say you're encumbered or anything, uh, you will, it will take you, um, it will make you slower. Sorry, I, I keep forgetting what I'm thinking about because I'm always trying to hear and pay attention to everything that's going on outside. Put you in number five, and let's hit number four. Fix up our torch. And hit six. And we want him. There we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and put some stuff away. Um, let's put our hide away. Let's put these, but a couple of them away. I'll keep five. Um, I'll keep five of those also. And we'll put up all these berries right now I'll keep the other berries on me um, because basically when we find something if we knock something out we want to be able to uh, to narc it up uh, I mean uh, not narc we, we don't want the narcs on us that's right uh, but we do want to keep these red ones and these blue ones on us because you know for when we need food or whatever else now we got some pretty good um, weight going on Let's see if we can go find some uh, something else to kill right quick, because oh shit, here comes this guy. There we go. Hold on, let me kill this guy. Nope, and we're dead. Fuck. So, that really sucked. Um, we want to respawn back around there because we don't want to lose our base. That's for sure. Let's see if we can get back to our base. Hopefully this fucker died. Because, yeah, there he is. There's our house. Well, at least we didn't die far. So, we're going to run up on him. And we're just going to start punching him because he should still be about dead. He should be pretty close to being dead. Come on, you fucking lag! Yeah, bitch. Um, I don't think I have the meat to tame him, do I? Oh, I need my other bag. Let me get my other bag first. Hey, I said E. Take all. Thank you. 
I have no meat. All I have is cooked meat. Uh, let's see. Do we have anything around here? Let's go ahead and make us up another spear. And there's going to be nothing here. If we can get some shark meat down there. Get one of them big old sharks. Yeah, that's not happening. Alright, let's just go ahead and kill him. You must be sacrificed to the gods. To the gods of the dinosaurs. Where'd you go? There you are. Sorry, little guy. I would train you, but I don't have the meat for it. And you have to die for it. You tried to kill me. So, you know, that's what you get when you try to kill me. You die for dying. What else is in here? Oh. Just the skins and stuff. I don't need that, huh? We do not need none of that. Alright guys, my timer's about to go off, and we're coming up to the end of this episode. So, that's gonna do it. Uh, you know, it, we died, but at least we respawned pretty close, and we were able to get back and get everything settled. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give me a like, and until next time, later!